A hundred years ago in Shanghai, there was a British tycoon named Harry Lester. He was rich, but didn't own a car and used buses. Didn't marry or have children. Before he died in 1936, Lester donated almost all his assets to build the Lester Chinese Hospital, the Harry Lester Institute of Technical Education, and the Harry Lester Institute of Medical Research. It's been almost 100 years since. Harry Lester passed away, but his legacy glistens in the city center of Shanghai. Hello, I'm Michelle Chiao. Please explore Shanghai with me. The architectural legacies donated by British merchant Harry Lester nearly a century ago have been well preserved in Shanghai. Let's go and have a look. The Harry Lester Institute of Medical Research is located in downtown Shanghai. Founded in 1932. The three-story building is modern in style. It was designed by Lester Johnson and Morris, a famous architecture firm founded by Lester. At the time, press said it would be the best equipped hospital of its kind. The institute focused on the study of public health with its clinical, physiology, and pathology departments. It had nearly 100 employees. They devoted themselves to research, published valuable papers, and trained medical professionals for modern China. This institute of medical research was built according to the will of British billionaire Harry Lester. It had nearly 100 employees. 90 years ago, foreign and Chinese medical experts took a group photo here, right in front of this. Modern gate. The entrances are flanked by two long corridors. One extends to a lecture hall, and on the other hand was a medical library. In 1957, Shanghai Institute of Pharmaceutical Industry was founded here. Now the building is empty. The lecture room had a stage and preparation rooms behind it. Lectures on medical research were conducted weekly. In the 1930s,、uh, many famous lectures hosted here, and the famous virologist Dr. F. F. Tang lectured on the futile virus in this room. Here used to be the famous library for the Harry Lester Institute of Medical Research. A lot of scholars would applied to do research here.、Uh, in addition to a large amount of medical books, this institute also had a lot of uh, uh, precious specimen, including bone fossils and Chinese herbs. Lei Shi De is a in Shanghai this city development history is worth reading, but is still often forgotten by the people. In 1863, he came to Shanghai and began his career. He spent a long time in Shanghai and spent a long time in Shanghai. He was a very low-class man in the lower classes. He was a very low-class man in the lower classes. He was a very low-class man in the lower classes. 是除了这个贫苦病弱的这些弱势群体以外，其实大量他的关注点用到了我们的这个医院、医药以及教育方面，把他的这个财富是用于之后的这个城市、这个国家的人民的发展之中去，这才是他的伟大之处。There are laboratories on the second and third floors, which are made of units that can be divided. Each room has its own purpose. Chinese and foreign medical experts did a lot of experiments here. On the second floor of the building, there used to be a rainbow of labs. Many medical experts made interesting experiments here.、Uh, they analyzed the nutrition of soya beans and also Chinese herbs. The Harry Lester Institute of Medical Research did not last long. It was founded in 1932, but suspended operations in World War II. However, there had been a lot of research here, such as analyzing the nutritional components of soya beans and researching Chinese herbal medicine. 
The building has a flat roof. It is open, bright, and spacious. The interior is some four meters high. With large windows and good lighting, it's warm in winter and cool in summer. Minus the main building, the institute has staff dormitories and a space to raise animals for research. Rooms are built around the central courtyard and very unique. Shanghai brought Harry Lester great opportunities and wealth. He returned his fortune to the city. In a will filled with kindness and love, he wrote, "I declared that my principal and permanent home has always been, and that it still is and will be in Shanghai, in China." The building of Harry Lester Institute of Medical Research survives and glistens. With the lights of science and love in Shanghai city center.